Hey guys, it's Neil from the Skullbusters, and before we get started today, I just want to give a big shout out to our newest super fan member, Matt Moore. If you want to join Matt Moore and becoming a member, just hit the button below and don't forget to subscribe. So getting back to today's video, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to get gold for International B Master License. So let's get started on IB1. So these can be a bit tricky. Um, it's all about your breaking points really so I'm going to pause it on the breaking point so you can see so there you go the first breaking point is 150 meter mark so you want to drop it right down get off the brakes about now halfway round don't snatch the brake uh, the accelerator too soon just casually on and off with the accelerator and then back on as fast as you can try not to step the back end out otherwise it will oversteer and you will lose traction um, but hopefully this will help you achieve gold just quickly show you my settings as always automatic on controller traction control on one everything is turned off I get a lot of questions uh, asking about my controller settings they're all set to default nothing's changed so let's move on to the next one IB2 and this one again um, as you can see traction control is on one um, this one you're kind of doing a bit of lift and coasting and you can do it flat out but I just give it a slight little lift and back on and then you get to around this point here just before the 200 meter back just drop uh, the, and brake here now just off the brake about now at the 50 meter mark board and then just nice and easy don't put your foot down completely so you just be gentle with the accelerator and then put your foot down once the car is kind of straightening up uh, if you do snatch it too soon the back end will step out again um, so hopefully that'll help and again my settings um, traction control is set to one on all mine uh, if it's different I will tell you so everything's switched off so let's move on to the next one now this is a tricky one um, because it's on snow and it's a little bit unpredictable um, settings, uh, as you can see, the torque distribution is uh, offset to 6040, and we're looking for our braking point, and it's here, just after the second board. So you're braking really early. On the brake, off the brake, and let flip the car in, and then get up the accelerator as it's starting to go right halfway round, so you can get a good exit and a lot of speed coming out of there. And then you want to just come to the right hand side here just give it a nice touch of the brake and you're just bringing it right down and then just nice and easy on and off on and off and then flick it into the corner back on try not to flick it too much again because you will oversteer so hopefully that will help you achieve gold again quickly show you my settings Um, there's no traction control because it's on uh, snow so that doesn't matter everything's turned off so okay now that's done let's move on to the next one and the next one is IB4 there we go and this one as you can see traction control is on one and what you want to do is lift and close there's no point breaking through all the sections so you kind of like lifting off and back on with R2 if you're on controller like I am, lift on and off, on and off, on and off, and then again through here, and then as you see the apex here on the right hand side, there is your braking point. I have got my traction control on two on this one, it helps stabilise the car a little bit for me, I don't know if you want to use that method, it's up to you. So that was the only, you just want to give a little lift through this section, uh, but that's the only little braking point, and it's only small braking, it's nothing big or heavy. It's just a little dab of the brake and then back on again as fast as you can. So it's quite straightforward. Like I said, I did have the traction control on two on this one. It's set by uh, it's set at one by default, but make sure you have it on two. And everything else is turned off. Okay, let's move on to the next one. So the next one is IB5, and this one can be a little bit trickier. So again. I have set my traction control to two. 
and we're looking for our first big breaker which is here at the 400 meter mark so you want to drop it right down and then get off the brake now and then another little touch of the brake here little touch just so that the car can move to the left inside here that's it so you can clip that apex and then back on the accelerator as fast as you can lift off as you're coming around here no need to brake so you just need a, a slight little lift and then back on and then you're moving on to the right hand side and there is your next braking point brake nice and early just before the 200 meter mark off the brake let the car roll now and then you feather in the accelerator and then full left foot down coming out of the corner and moving over to the left hand side and we're braking early now again just before the 200 meter mark so you lift off the accelerator braking now all the way down off the brake now let the car roll see so on and off again with r2 on and off on and off and then now fully put down with r2 and hopefully it should give you a good traction to get gold like I say, I will always tell you if I change my traction control. Um, like I say, it is always set to one as default. But if I feel like I need to change it, I will let you know. So as you always, on controller, on this one, put traction control on two. It's automatic, everything else is switched off. And that hopefully should get you gold. Let's move on to the next one. IB6. Again, another little trick you want this one. Some of these cars are a bit oversteer so that's why i've changed the traction control but this one it was not too bad on one so i've left it on this is flat out and um, you can give a little lift if you need to and um, i just kind of like lifting them back on straight away and this is your braking point here so you're braking nice and early drop it down off the brake now back on the accelerator now and then another little slight touch of the brake here so it's just a little dab of the brake then off the brake dead quick so a little touch off the brake feather that accelerator and then now back on fully flat out here move over to the right hand side don't go on the grass and then here's your braking point nice and early nice and early then off the brake as quick as you can there let the car roll don't get on it yet and now back on the accelerator because you will end up on the right hand side there if you go too early on the right, on the accelerator. Hopefully that will help you achieve gold. If you are struggling, maybe try traction control two. But I found traction control one was very doable for me on this. So again, automatic traction control one. Everything is turned off. So let's move on. To the next one IB7 again another tricky one so as soon as we start we're gonna break now here 200 meter mark you see the board on the left that's your breaking point really early done slam on them anchors drop the car down off the bait now go for that corner nice and tight through this section and then on and off the accelerator lift off and then back on no need to brake there flat out coming out that corner We're looking for our next braking point there it is the board on the left hand side it says 100 meter mark that's your braking point nice and early dropping it right down here off the brake now on and off the accelerator on and off on and off on and off and then now pull it r2 right down Here's your next braking point. Nice and early again. So you're lifting off and brake into the corner off the brake nice and early. Let the car roll through the accelerator on and off, on and off, and then flat out over the start finish. And that hopefully should help you achieve gold. Again, that's another one way. If you might be struggling, try traction control too. But I found it was doable, definitely with one. Automatic traction control on one. Like I say, try to if you're struggling. Everything else is turned off. So let's move on to the next one. IB8. Another little tricky one. We're in the wet. Traction control on 
the reef improves this massively okay so again you've just got to kind of like be gentle with the accelerator there's your first braking point 100 meter mark so we're braking dropping it right down off the brake now if you need to just give it a little touch of the brake just to correct the car then do so there's your second braking point going into the next corner off the brake just gently nice and gently the accelerator and then once the car straightens up go for it you will get a lot of traction because it's on traction control three and it will help the car i think it'll that is doable on traction control three and um, i did struggle with all the others so on controller automatic change it to three i know it's set to one that's my default setting change it to three it will help you'll see an improvement everything else switched off as always hopefully that will help you get gold let's move on to ib9 another tricky one we're on snow again bit unpredictable but if you keep your car as straight as possible braking a straight line sounds daft but it helps nice and early braking in to the corner off the brake nice and tight flick it in on now so you should kind of like straighten the car up little touch of the brake here little touch nothing major just a nice little touch flick it in try and go as tight as possible to get a good exit you see that exit beautiful foot down all the way and that should help you get gold a bit of a tricky one that one so with this one there is no traction control because we're on snow got on controller automatic everything is switched off and we're on to the last one so it's IB10 another tricky one car's a bit of an handful so I found traction control 2 helps stabilize this car from oversteer gives you a bit of traction in the corners and braking as well as coming out of the exits uh, there is our braking point there's a little board on the right hand side there that was your braking point 150 meter mark so we're dropping it right down Try and pinch a bit of that corner, be tight with this one, on and off with the accelerator. Try not to go on the grass like I did, but it doesn't help too much. Because you will lose a bit of speed. There is our next braking point. Nice and early, off the brake, feather that accelerator, on and off, on and off. And then now flat out. And then we're looking for our next braking point. And now, nice and early, just at the end of that little curb on the left there, braking into the corner, off the brake. Aim for the apex, clip it, go over it, flat out now, coming out that exit, sweep to the left hand side, you can be a little bit more to the left, uh, but this was still doable, so you're braking, touch of the brake, and then now go for that apex there, nice and tight, good exit, that's what it's about, you need good exits, good nice clean racing lines through this, and that should help you achieve gold. So as I said, traction control 2, I found it very doable. So if you are struggling, put it on 2, that's how I got mine. Like I say, always on control, it's on with, uh, always on automatic. Set to 1 is default, but I'd recommend put it on 2. Everything else is switched off. And then that means we've got all of them gold. That's our reward. And the last car we've just done is the car that you collect. Okay guys, I hope this guide helps. If it did, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.